All right, ladies and gentlemen, it's time to get our opening contest. VABL proudly brought to you by Headspace and Australian Urethane and Skyrene. Introducing first from the blue corner, please welcome Yi Sia. Proudly brought to you by Australian Neurothane and Styrene and Headspace. Introducing first MRI right, fighting out of the blue corner. Trained by Steve Stedball from North Melbourne Boxing and Fitness. Official weight 52.8 kilograms. Standing 5 feet 3 and a half inches tall. Tonight we're in the blue shorts, we're in the white trim. Fighting out of the Melbourne CBD. Please welcome Yi Sia. And our opponent tonight, then, fighting out of the red corner, trained by Joe Nader from the Power Play Gym. Official weight, 53.5 kilograms, standing 5 feet 6 inches tall. Tonight we're in the red, red shorts with a white trim. Ladies and gentlemen, the world renowned VJ, this is Ruby Rose. Ladies, please, Sarah, please, for final instructions. Well, good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the Mooney Valley Racing Course Proving Ground. Saturday the 20th of October, proudly brought to you by Joe Nader and Powerplay Promotions. My name is John Fergus. Joining me tonight, Fivo Christodoulou, the man behind Track Visual that's putting them together a lot of the media here tonight. Fivo, a huge card here tonight. Absolutely fantastic. I'm really excited, especially for the main big, event, Bushy. Big world title coming up for the main event. But first of all, we've got coming up Ruby Rose taking on Yi Sai. So it's going to be made a huge night here. Where's Kepa, main event. So both girls oh. making their debut here tonight. Seconds out, round one. So Ruby Rose fighting out of the red. Yee Sia out of the blue corner. It's three two-minute rounds of boxing rules. Well, they're not afraid to engage, are they? They're both girls are going to be very tentative, mate. Both girls making their debut here in centre ring tonight. Big crowd here at Proving Ground. And Joe Nate of Powerplay Promotions again done another sensational job. Stack card. Footwork from both girls moving around the ring, not just standing there. Yep. Good from Ruby, she keeps going forward. She's got her on yeah. the back foot now up against the rope. Height and reach advantage going the way of Ruby Rose. Good work for me to get out of the way. Good hands. Very good. Spent a bit of time in the front of the tattoos uh, needle as well as Ruby Rose. <laughs> Good, uh, good that work. jab's working for Ruby. You can see she's obviously got the longer reach, so a big right. Yeah, she's had the benefit of uh, moving around with Sarah Missy Howard in the power play gym. Absolutely, and she packs a punch, believe me. I've been on the receiving end of this. <laughs> <laughs> good right hand there from Ruby Rose. You yeah, great. content to use her left hand at the moment. Good footwork. So it's good to see in the first round both girls are, are not uh, tentative to engage at all. They're really getting in there. Ruby mixing it up, going to the body. Really impressed with the way the girls are. They're not just standing flat-footed for you. Uh, they're, yeah, they're using their angles as well. Yeah. And they haven't been in the game for that long. So I must say, uh, very good movement for girls that are, I guess, relatively, relatively new to the sport. Oh, very good reach. A bit of claret flowing from the nose of Yi Sia at the moment. So good first round there from both girls. Proudly brought to you by Head Start and Australian Urethane and Sirene. One down, two to go. So round two of our opening bout. Ruby Rose fighting in the red corner. Yi Sia fighting in the blue corner. Big thanks to the Australian Urethane and Sirene and Headspace. This is proving ground. Ruby's come out quite aggressive, moving forward. Yeah, I think they've got yeah. that first round out of the way, Fever. So they're, you know, they're, they're comfortable now in centering. They've seen what their yeah. opponents have got to offer. Absolutely. Keep going to the body again and going upstairs. 
Of course, Fibo from uh, Track Visual does a lot of the uh, media work behind the scenes for Joe Nader and Powerplay Promotions. You put together the video clips that are shown throughout the fights. That's right, and it's good. Uh, you get to find um, to talk to the fighters, I guess, behind the scenes and find out a lot. Um, yeah, the claret really starting to, to flow from the nose of Yeesia. It's got to give Ruby a bit of confidence seeing that Absolutely. she's landed something that's... quite pleased with that. Um, you can see her confidence building up. She's going forward more and more. And, uh, I think Ruby knows uh, she's got it so far, so she's got to, she's going to keep the pressure on. I was going to say, she looks a little bit tentative just letting her right hand go as well. Yep. And uh, we're just stopping again. Just, looking. just getting the doctors to have a look at you see her. It, it's a bit of claret starting to flow from the nose, and it's you know it's both girls making the debut. Amateur so boxing. I think they'll be fine to go on. Yep. Just a bit of blood will be fine, and here we go. Resuming back in centering. It's like to see Ruby let her right hand go a little bit more, but she's sticking that jab out, Fibo, and it's really finding its mark. Absolutely. Oh, here we go. Oh, oh, and UC oh, has turned her back, so good sportsmanship there from Ruby. She could have unloaded there, but she didn't. Yep. I think she knows she's up on the scorecard, so she doesn't need to be mean. <laughs> but uh, he's not out of it yet. You can see she still wants to fight. She's put in the hard yards, Ruby Rose. Not only being a big media personality, she's spending a lot of time in the gym, but again, full credit to the UCA train by Steve yeah. Stenborg. Yeah, he actually uh, landed a few uh, stiff jabs in there as well. So, um, I think the reach is working for Ruby. Here we go, the third and final round, proudly brought to you by Headspace and Australian Urethane and Styrene. Ruby Rose up on the cards at the moment. That's it. Some more stiff jabs. Good. Good. And you moving forward. That's it. Been just, that right hand's cock looking like it's ready to go, but she just hasn't been throwing it enough for good work at the moment. He's firing back. She's She's wearing a few though. Yeah, big hands from Ruby Rose, but ye see her as well. Up against the ropes. Both girls just trading. And ye is getting backed up. Ruby's just left, right, left, right. Yeah, ye see her just turning her back again. Jim Nomikos keeping a good close eye. He's enjoying himself in centering <laughs> as well. I think all Ruby needs to do now is just keep the pressure up and she's got this in the bag. Yeah, good but work there from UC, just threw out a nice stiff left as well. Neither girl have uh, elected to go to the body tonight, they're just all head punches tonight, Fibo. Absolutely, but uh, it's the fight game, anything can still happen. <laughs> you need Joe Nader through the effects microphone, just saying keep going, girls. Final 30 seconds! Watch the girls bring it home now, final 30 seconds. He's standing your ground. Right, 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 right. Yes. Steve Stenborg just calling out to you, see her just to stand her ground, use the jab. Yeah, she'll be finding it a bit hard to breathe, so I think she's doing quite well. But yeah, she's still moving. Go, go for it, go for it! Yeah, good, good sportsmanship there from Ruby, just as. Yeah. Do not. There you go, mate. Great, great effort from both girls this first out. Proudly brought to you by Headspace and Australian Urethane and Sovereign. Ruby Rose and Yee Seer. This one will go to the judges. Ladies and gentlemen, before we go to the judges' scorecard, a big round of applause to both ladies for a fantastic opening contest. Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds of action, we go to the judges' scorecard. It is a unanimous decision. Your winner, Fred Connor, the Thorn. Oh, there you go, Fibo. Unanimous points decision win to Ruby Rose. Congratulations to both girls making their debut here tonight in front of a big crowd. You. Very appropriately named Ruby Brown. Both girls had something to prove in there. And look forward to seeing them both back in centering again. I was very happy.